Yes, that's right, Bob. Three more deaths have been confirmed in the West General Hospital. The death toll is now up to 28, as three unknown gunmen came in and beat shooting officers and personnel outside. Two of the shooters were gunned down, while one is at large with one... Jesus fucking Christ! Uh, are you kidding me? They blew up the lab too? The lab would be important to them. But yeah, we got little to no case on him now. No doubt. Well, no doubt from the atolls. They usually don't like it when this shit goes around. Lawyer had the balls and say to drop most of the charges he was accused of, thanks to the lab going up in smoke. Doesn't mean he works for them, too. I can't stay on the line much longer, but I'll give you a lead. His lawyer, John Constantinople. He works for David Atoll and just got him out of a petty case not too long ago. A DUI. But if he had something to deal with it, he'll be your guy. I can't give you guys proof, but maybe he'll know more. I didn't say anything. So good luck and good hunting. For fuck's sakes! That was our biggest break. Yeah. I know, but it means something. It? A. Really piss them off, and B. Means what measures they're gonna do to keep anything in power. Now I know this constant uh, the, the fella, I know, I know him. Who doesn't know this guy? He's got holographic pillboards all over the place. So he's a popular lawyer in that. Fifteen years of defending people. Ninety percent win rating. Did the, uh, Rourke trial, the Anul trial, and the Carter trial- Oh, at all! Oh. Yeah, I remember this name. What? He did Jeffrey Machine Gun Hammer Oliver's trial too. He got him acquitted for over 30 murders. He was like, big enforcer for the Atolls till he got gunned down. A lot of the other defendants below also were members of the group. All but three acquitted. Media tried to find out if he worked for them until one reporter, Sheila Howling, was found dead in her apartment. Got strangled to death and her home was in flames. God knows how they found her corpse if it was on fire, but hell, they did. He sounds just like Val. A big-ass lawyer with lots of money. And to keep people out of jail. <laughs> and another perfect candidate. He has a building down on the western side of the city. It's guarded pretty well. You know, if we do take him down, they... they won't like it. They deserve it. And more. Since he's a big lawyer, he's probably got lots of digital and paper trails, but I really need to show you something, you know, in case if it happens to us. Nothing's gonna happen to you, stop saying that shit. If they're gonna do that shit to the police station, just imagine what they'll do to you. No, but for real, seriously, I need you to take a look at this, in case anything happens. Did you see about that shooting in the cop station? Bastards got what was coming. Corrupting pieces of shit. Could be the Star Cartel again. I heard it was from random. Alright, I'm in. Security cameras are down once you get narrow. I got enough charge to make sure they stay down. And get going. Jaden, the entrance is covered by a lot of people, but there's a door in the semi container that you can get inside of. Right. Any key places we can hit yet? One besides the lawyer. There's a vault on the first floor that has guards protecting it. Shit. I can't see inside of it, but there is a huge electric spike in there. So, there could be a lot of lockers. <laughs> Just maybe a server. Sounds like our jackpot. Bad news is that your target is on the top floor with the Atoll grubs. So, he might be expecting you. Figured he would. Hold up. For Mr. C is the gold one. Takes it up to the 53rd level. Guns check, key check, getting the fuck out of here.
Damn, this is an easy fucking job. Watch this guy for 20 bucks an hour? Yeah, it's easy. That fucker isn't gonna go through us. Yeah, yeah. Say that to the other guards he fucked up. I mean, didn't you hear what he did to the mountain? Yeah, he had cops with him. He could be working for them. I don't care. I'll be lighting him up real quick with this shit. Es como si estuvieran midiendo sus propias pollas o algo así. Son jodidamente molestos. Sir, were you expecting a visitor at this time? He's black in uniform. Not at this time. Get him out of here. Yes, sir. Hey, buddy. You're not allowed on this floor. Yeah, idiots like you aren't allowed up here. You better move down. Yo, what the? Hey, it's that layaway guy. Get him. Get security up here. That layaway cunt is on the top floor. <sighs> it's the same shit day in and day out. They still freak the hell out from all of that banging. I just want to move to the floors below. Just from this stuff. They don't care about others, do they? Grenade! Hello, John. Ooh, hola. John Concessi Noble at your service, sir. How can I help you today? The vault. Take me to it. Ooh, that vault is restricted access only. Shut the fuck up and take me to it. No, don't shoot. Open it. ¿Quieres que me asustes al abrir esta puerta? Sí. Open it. You don't know what you're gonna get into. All of this is private. All of it. He'll kill me. Why don't you pay attention to me? What do you think I'll do if you don't open the vault? Lady, out. But okay, don't fucking move. Damn, that's a lot of money and jewelry. Wait, Jaden, insert your disk extractor into that server. It looks like a mix of UNSC and Covenant. Is this a private power server? By the looks of it, yeah. Looks Sangheili related though, so... Uh, stand by. <laughs> no doubt this is a private server. With a very tough security detail. Stand... by and got it. Hurry, hurry, Jimmy. What do you see? Hang... Holy fuck. Oh my god! What? What? What's wrong? Uh, this server, it has everything! It has operator names, a location of factories, drug houses, blackmail stuff, orders, everything! Fucking everything! It, it's the fucking jackpot! H hold up. Everything? Why here at all places? No doubt for reassurance purposes and copies. I mean, he is a close ally and can be trusted to put it in the vault while not even a cop can think twice, let alone a novice hacker. Hold up, I got something else. Is it David Atoll in a G-string? <laughs> I wish, but no. That involves you. Or the text involving you. About man Mason? Dude, David, Val, and Andrew Atoll were talking on how to frame you. Jesus, all that shit? That's them. This means I got fucking framed by the adults. 
Get as much as possible, and I mean everything. Hold up, I know nothing. You know a lot more. Why here? Why not have the server at third place? No one goes in that safe besides me and a few close personal of mine. I'm close friend with Andrew Otto. He trusts me, okay? I owe him a few things, but we talk in the end of putting his private server in my place. And helped him and his cronies with legal trouble inside and out. You fucking piece of shit! Jen, I got a lot of data saved. I can't get all of this stuff. You better destroy that place, so they won't be able to back up any of that shit. Right. I got a better idea. I'm not gonna kill you. Oh no. You're gonna tell them what happened. Wait, me? What are you gonna do? This. continue where Mr. Carter left off that. Now John, you were at work, as always, dealing with another case while at least half a dozen of my men protected you. Not only did Mr. Layway come into the floor and dispatch them, but also killed the guards downstairs and gave you access to the vault. John, do you realize what was inside that vault? Of course I do. Lots of money, jewelry, and cases that were active and close. Not to mention that server. Do you realize what was inside that server, John? A whole list of current and past operatives, locations of all my safe houses, drug houses, bases of operation, list of orders from other cartels and other organizations, shipment orders, blackmail, and leverages all throughout the planet. That server was priceless, John! It even had all of our texts from our meetings and other clients. You? 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 Put that in that server? John! Those were kept in secret. You promised that. I did keep our promise. But I used it in case those clients decided to bail on us. If the police get their hands on that data, it will destroy us. The Empire will crumble in days. No one will be safe. Not even you. We can tell them obviously that it was fake and it was all made in pretend. He'll be very damning, John. David will be kicked out of the office by then. And even if you do say that, a thorough investigation would begin and they would follow those trails. And my business would be destroyed thanks to you for saving those texts. I am not worried of your texts, John. I am more angered that you gave him access to that vault. You expected me to die over it? No. I expect you to lay your life out for it, and I would have sent my vengeance tenfold over him. You can even find and murder him. Your son is no less better. Then you are not much use now are you? What point should I have a lawyer if we were all to fall down? Not to mention one that cowers on the side. It's not my fault that you killed- But much like Mr. Wolfric and Mr. Val, you have failed me. Look, I'm sorry that this didn't go as expected, but- Oh no! No! Oh, oh, stop! Ah! 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 Ow! Oh, 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 <laughs> As you can see, gentlemen, a simple demonstration. Mr. Locus has proved his usefulness, while Mr. Carter and Mr. Constantinople has not. I will not tolerate failure. We will get the data back, we will be successful, and we will get Mr. Layaway. Wait, 
Are you serious? This is where he lives? In that slum ass place. Damn. No wonder he was hard to find. Shut the fuck up and keep calm. There's a hot spot here. He wasn't working alone. Quick, get Andrew Atoll on the line. Right now. Mr. Atoll, Max Geiger is on the line. It's important. It better be important. Put him through. Mr. Geiger, this better be important. I already had to kill my friend and lawyer. Tell me you have something. The ghetto slums on the west side of the city. He's living in a dual apartment. House number 821 on Murphy's Avenue. You mean he's been living close to the city the whole time? Yeah, he went inside. He's not living alone. He's living with someone else. A guy named Jimmy Osborne. He was a common drug runner for you and a hacker. And he worked with a former associate of ours. Excellent work. Do not go in. I am getting men in there. Get the data and bring it to me as soon as possible. Yes, sir. I'd want to kill the fucking bastard if that's possible. No, Mr. Geiger. You have done enough. Let my son handle it. Stay there and stay hidden. Get my son on the line right away. On the way, sire. Ugh, <laughs> oh, my head. Hello? David, we have found Mr. Lateway. He is living with a Mr. Osborne at house number 821 at Murphy's Avenue. I need you there immediately. R really? Fuck. Alright, I'm on my way. Mr. Geiger will wait for you, along with a few men. I want you to grab more men from the entertainment center and bring Locust with you. Really? He's awkward to be with. You I want no more excuses, David. I want you to get the data back from them. And when you do, kill Mr. Osborne painfully. He has violated our name for the very last time. Destroy the apartment and kill everyone in it. And let Locust kill Mr. Layaway. You, you got it, Dad. I'll make sure they'll never fuck with us again. I hope so, David, for your sake. I will not be so forgiving if he lives. I don't know if I recorded the last episode with the new mic. If I did, this doesn't matter. But if I didn't, hey, new mic. I'm Jimmy Osborne. I'm a guard five. And I'm a servant. Man, I need something like proper villainy. We're going to tell them, obviously, what... Now, I know this Constantinople fella. Now, I know this constant noble f constant I I don't know how to say that. Look, I'm sorry that did this I media tried to find out if he worked for them until one reporter, a uh, Sheila Howling, was found fuck me sideway. Wow. Uh, actually this one's not whispering. Haha. <laughs> this server it, it has everything. It has operator names. Look, shall going to take that again. Media tried to find out if he worked for them under... Um, the text from Mr. Max Gage... Fuck. Holy fuck. 
can only say this so many times without laughing. 